Yo guys, welcome back to another video. So, in today's video, we're going to be messing around with Flux Storage, or Flux Networks. Um, main reason being, uh, I think it's time to get into refined storage. Get rid of all these chests, and then we can start getting our automation going for mechanism and really start getting into this pack. So, what do we need to get into this? Yeah, buttload of obsidian. Uh, we have some eyes vendor and flux dust, which is made with redstone and obsidian on bedrock. Uh, we have some obsidian, but um, let's actually just go to the actual end. We go to the actual end. We, we can just mine these. That'll be alright. That guy's gonna break. Should be enough. I mean, we really don't even need this much obsidian. We just need like one piece. I can type. Yeah, because that all went into my dank anyways. Oh, nope. That all went into my backpack. Turn this off. And then good stone. Okay, now we need bedrock. Which our mine should be sufficient. I believe it goes all the way down. I don't know what that noise was, but that was frightening. So I haven't done too much off camera. Uh I've actually been away for a couple days, so I haven't really been playing. But we're back. And we are like jumping down. Alright. So I believe it's piece of obsidian and then redstone under. Right click. Left click. It was left click. Okay. Now, what does the quest do for us? Gives us some more and a random reward, which was speed. Which I believe we already have. Yeah. Actually, let's... We'll do that. Okay, and then... We need these guys and we need well we don't want all of it okay and then we'll go that should be enough to get started i think We want a plug and a point. Oh, well, we are going to need redstone. And one of these, I think, I think point is what we want the most of. Plug receives. That is loud. So if we put a flux plug on our advanced energy cube here. We set up a network. Create. Now, we should have, um... This should pull power. But only if it needs it. So... I guess, uh, the only way to really know if it's working is to give something power. Oh, uh, 
let's get rid of the obsidian, the flux blocks. We'll toss this stuff in here for now, but not you. And let's get into refined storage. So, this is actually one of my favorite mods. Uh, quartz enriched iron. That'd be the biggest thing first. Uh, iron. Put that. Uh, this guy. All right, so that's a start. We need a bunch of these machine casings. I know we got stone somewhere. I had to make a bunch for this place. So, first thing is machine casing. A controller is some silicon and an advanced processor. Uh, the processor binding might be a bit of an issue. We have some slime. Not a lot. I know I was, I started making silicon already. Yeah. yeah I thought I, I pre-made some. Anticipating this. And string. All right, processor binding, not a lot. We need diamond and redstone, diamond, redstone. We're also going to need iron ones and gold ones. So we can go ahead and just, we're gonna make 10 of each for now. Just to get started. Plus, we don't have a lot of slime to work with. Ten of each. Get them smelting. Then, uh, what else do we need? Finding, we have all this. It's just, just the processors. So we can just... Controller. Just like that. With the controller made, we can get going into the rest of it. So we're going to need some cables, which is glass, uh, enriched iron, and redstone. I don't think I actually have any more glass. I think I've been using it all. Jeez Louise, that's loud. We're turning zombie off. I don't even care if I can come back. And then Gollum. Okay. Cable. You don't need this much, but better to have some than none. Be right back. All right, so after the controller, we need a grid, which is another casing, and then these construction cores, and deconstruction cores, or destruction. Then you have a grid. Then you need a crafting table. And another advanced processor, I believe. Or a crafting grid. All right. So, oh, of course, it's one chest that's full. Oh wow, this thing's fast. Whoopsie. Um, and then we want to place this down here. Uh, 
I thought I had this step assist off. I do, it must be one of these. Yeah, the boots. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, and then... We want to put a point on the back. Flux point we just made with that. And we have wireless power. Easy peasy. Just like that. Boom, bam. And we keep the floor design. Can't really see back there too much. But then we want... We're gonna want cables. And next would be disk drives, which is a chest, more machine casings. So we're just going to make four, make some chests. And then disk drive. Make two. We're not going to need two right away, but there's two. Because now is the hardest part of this whole, um, the hardest part of this whole mod is actually creating the disk drives because they are very resource heavy. Um, looks like we can make a 1k right off the bat, which is cool. Um, what are we missing? Glass. All right, let me go gather some glass and I'll be back. Okay, so we now have a stack of glass. Not a lot, but it'll get us going. Well, now we need more quartz and rich iron. Moving up to the 4Ks now. What are we missing? Oh, we're missing all of them. And we're missing more of basic process. What are we out of in this? Huh. Iron. That's easy enough. We got plenty of that. That's the rest of, almost the rest of that. What are we missing now? Oh, redstone. Um, that should be fine. Hopefully. Redstone. Oh, wow. I got fine ink. The idea is we want nine of these to make at least a 16k. Um, don't think we're going to have enough for that. What we need? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six more of these. Well, we don't have enough for that. Oh, we can make a 16k. We can make two 16ks. Oh, man. We almost make a 64k. Uh, not what we're gonna do though. Glass. Four K storage disc. All right. Now with these storage discs, we can plop them in here. Each get a light on both sides. 
And now, if we were to slap our crafting grid down, temporary spot, by the way, we can now start filling this inventory with blocks. But we don't want any of these big resources in here because we're also going to get further into functional storage with packing drawer we need stone pistons iron drawers easy enough let me get a bunch of these crafted and i'll be right back okay so now with these we can start tearing into this a little bit uh we don't want to completely tear it down but um what we can actually do is set this here is the storage controller this will be able to read every single one of these and then we want to just I didn't think I got into these much, but well, we just want to basically cover this wall and um these guys here. And I'll show you why. Um, get rid of all these parts. We're gonna um, take each ingot one by one, and that's how we want them stored. Doing this goes, um, it'll show nugget, ingot, block. And if you just put the ingot in, it'll go block and then, uh, compressed. That, we don't want that. Uh, diamonds and redstone, you don't do. You just use normal drawers. So we can do that. Oh, crap. Uh, get rid of this guy here. We can go normal oak drawer. And then diamonds. Just like that. I mean, obviously, we'd be able to um, use, you know, regular chest still. Wouldn't kill it, wouldn't hurt it, none. But it's just uh, easier if we use a method like this to store some of these other resources. Um, quartz being one, coal being another. Um, these crystals, I don't really care. Um, prosperity shards, maybe. Same with dimensional shards. Just, you know, not right now to get started. Pressed iron, not really. Stone. A lot of these I just don't care to do. Um, I like all the modium. Well, I might not get that in bulk. So let's, uh... I'm going to go through and fill up this wall and probably this wall with them, and I'll be right back. All right, so I got this set up pretty well. Uh, basic storage here. But we also want to get a external storage. This guy. Which means we need iron and redstone. Which redstone and iron are hooked up. Might be hooked up there, not hooked up here. Duh. We need two more basic processors. Ow. We need destruction core, destruction core, external storage. And that one, what we're doing pretty much is just hooking this guy to here, and we're going to give the priority of one. The higher the number, the higher the priority. This takes priority over that. So, if, for example, a stack of iron, two stacks of iron, this is at 662. 
if we toss it in here, it won't go into these drives here. Like, it won't go in here. It goes into the storage. If we have a drawer hooked up, that's where we want it to go. Oh, crap. I need all that. Spruce. Logs. Planks. Log. Log, 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 log. Plank, 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 log. And we are more better. All right. Storage is somewhat better. This wall is kind of bland and ugly now, but no biggie. We'll get it sorted. But for today, this is it. This is, this is the episode. Refined storage is hooked up. Um, this is a diamond to netherite upgrade. Wow. Uh, we're gonna want gold in this guy. Cause we gotta, I gotta move all that in here now. We got a steel hammer. That's kind of useless. That's useful. Ooh, that's useful. Uh, put this on coal. Copper. Old for now. I also got to make more of these upgrades. Not too hard. I'll make a bunch off camera. Uh, we have plenty of copper for it. But other than that, I th think that's where I'm going to wrap it up. I think we could just learn that like that. And yeah, that sums it up, guys. I hope you did enjoy. Hope you learned something. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.